Welcome to IBM Support TV, where we answer questions and share technical support information, hints and tips on IBM products. How do I use a policy set and default bindings to sign and encrypt a message in WebSphere application server? This task is intended to help familiarize yourself with adding WS security constraints to a JAX WS application. In this video, you will create a custom policy and use the default bindings to attach them to a sample application, JAX WS Service Samples. The sample web services application, JAX WS Service Samples, is assumed to be installed. Do not proceed if the application is not installed. If you do not have it installed, refer to the comments section of the video for a link on how to install it. Log in the Solutions Console with your credentials. Expand Services. Expand Policy Sets. Click Application Policy Sets. Click New. Type Simple Sign ENC Policy. Click Apply. Click Add. Click WS Security. Click OK. Click Save. No, by default, the policy now has the following configuration. Timestamp sent in outbound messages. Timestamp required in inbound messages. Sign the request and the response of body, WS addressing header, and timestamp. Encrypt the request and the response of body and signature element in SOAP security header. Now we'll attach the policy that we've just created to all the service clients in the JAX WS service samples application. Expand applications. Expand application types. Click WebSphere Enterprise Applications. Click JAX WS service samples. Click Service Client Policy Sets and Bindings. Place a check on JAX WS Service Samples. Click Attach Client Policy Set. Click Simple Sign ENC Policy. Click WebSphere Enterprise Applications. Now we'll attach the policy to all the service providers in the JAX WS Service Samples application. Click JAX WS Service Samples. Click Service Provider Policy Sets and Bindings. Place a check on JAX WS Service Samples. Click Attach. Click Simple Sign ENC Policy. Click Save. After attaching the new policy to the application, you'll need to restart the JAX WS Service Samples application. Click Enterprise Applications. Place a check on JAX WS Service Samples. Click Stop. Place a check on JAX WS Service Samples. Click Start. Run the test application to make sure it works. Open the sample application. Choose Synchronous Echo. Type a test message. Important. Make sure that the service URL is pointing to the correct host and port. Click Send Message. You have successfully completed the setup. See the comments section for follow-on videos that show how to see the messages that are being sent between client and the provider. Thanks for watching this episode of IBM Support TV. Please leave a comment with topics you would like to see in future episodes. Until then, stay tuned.